Hi friends, this is Lindsay for So Fancy. In today's video tutorial, uh, we're showing you how to use a photo mug template. So in the coffee mug and tumbler design and template bundle, you'll find some um, pre-designed templates um, that have a space for your photographs that are perfect, perfectly designed to go on your mugs. So what we're going to do is show you um, how to use some free software, Silhouette Studio, um, to get those pictures into the uh, template, um, and then you can print them out, and um, they're perfect for sublimating onto a mug. So let's go ahead and get started. So first open Silhouette Studio and um, set the appropriate page size for printing. Then go to File Merge, and you'll find the photo mug template that you saved on your computer, and you'll add it to that open workspace. And then um, you may need to resize it to fit um, the size of mug that you're using, and you can do this by um, selecting the design and then typing the desired width of the template. Um, and if you make sure that lock icon is engaged and hit enter, then the height will be uh, adjusted automatically. Then go ahead and right click over this design and select release compound path from the drop down menu. And what that'll do is that um, releases um, the smaller parts of the design. And so you can then now click and select just the largest part and drag that um, underneath those other elements that were previously part of the compound path. Um, and these are the shape of the photos. And um, there are actually two parts of this um, photo shape, so um, go ahead and just select both of them, right click and select make compound path, um, and then do that for that second um, photo shape as well. Then go ahead and change the fill color um, to no fill. And then now go to file, merge, and add the desired photo to your workspace. And then you may need to um, resize the photo if it opens very large. But then select one of the photo shapes and click the bring to front button. And then click and drag it uh, over the photo and position where you want it on the photograph. Um, and if it's hard for you to see that outline, then you can change the line color um, of the photo shape um, to something darker. You can maybe add a line weight to make it thicker so it's easier to see. You will want to only resize the photo so that um, the photo shape is um, positioned exactly where you want it and um, the photo completely fills that shape. Um, you don't want to resize the shape itself, just the photograph. And then when you have that exactly where you want, then select both of them and open the modify panel and click crop. And then the photo is cropped to that exact shape of the photo mug template. So then what you can do is you can click and drag that photo and position it onto the photo mug template. And um, you would do the exact same steps um, for that second photo shape. And so then when you have it all complete, then you can just go ahead and print it out with your sublimation printer. You do want to make sure that you mirror it prior to printing. And then secure the printed transfer to the mug with some heat resistant tape and press it. And then when you remove the transfer, then you have this super special custom mug. So just be sure when you are pressing a larger template like this that goes all the way around the mug that you press the um, edges of it really well um, because uh, I didn't on the first one and so it's just a little faded um, around the edges um, near the handle on that first one but as long as you you know make sure that you press the get the edges really well then like on my second one um, it turned out absolutely gorgeous. So that's how you do it, my friends, using a mug photo template and adding in your own photographs and creating some really special and personalized custom projects. So uh, thanks so much for watching, everyone. I hope you have a great rest of your day, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye.